All right, guys, today we're going to do a compact linear base quick tutorial in Stormwix um, brought to you by Apple Group. All right, so real quick, uh, it's basically a slider that moves along a modular track. Um, use a throttle or a negative or positive input from 0 to negative 1 and 0 to 1 to move the slider um, each direction. Uh, we'll use a throttle in this case to do that. I'll show you how it works. Um, this could be used for anything from sliding a small crane across, um, an elevator, lots of different options. So the positive is going to move it left if you apply positive, and if you apply a negative value to it, it's going to move it to the right in this case. Um, to basically make a track, you need these linear extension tracks. If you'll notice, they need to be in line with it this way. I'll go top view so you can see a little better. So we'll go this way here. So positive is going to bring it to this end. Negative will bring it back. Um, it is two pieces. So if you were to build here, it'd be on the main. But if you were to build here, that's going to be what moves with that. So it's actually going to be a secondary piece. And I can show you that in the merge. So it's actually two pieces. Um, you need to keep them separate. Otherwise, nothing will happen. Um, we'll put a throttle down real quick, and the light was negative, and you can see how the arrows kind of match up here on them being hollow or filled in. Uh, we'll get them wired up. They do need power, both ends. And the logic for it is basically just the throttle value to the number here. You need to set the throttle, though, to allow a negative one. To one and we'll start it at zero so it doesn't move and we'll go ahead and spawn that in um, actually I'll show you real quick there is some options for it change the max power meaning how much weight it can move the more objects you have attached to that section and then you can change the gear ratio allowing you to move more weight or it'll change the speed um, not too heavy you can move it faster I'll fix the uh, I'm here so everybody can see just fine. All right. As you can see that linear, it's showing it's zero input and the electricity to it. If we were to go a negative number, nothing happens. It's just trying to go to the right. So we'll go to a positive number here. And you see everything that's attached there moves. If you had a higher number, the faster it moves. And you put it back to zero and that's basically it. Um, you could control that bunch of ways, microcontrollers, throttles, buttons, a whole bunch of options. A lot of guys use it to move weight on boats to create ballast systems too. Um, hope that helps out. See you guys on the next one.